Welcome to The Daily Me, the place for insights into life and business. Welcome to the show, and today I want to talk about what it takes to be a podcast guest and what you need to do to book yourself in. Now, there are a few steps that is involved in this process, and that really starts off early in the piece by making sure that uh, the topics that you want to talk about match with the podcasts that you want to appear on and their audience. What does the audience want? If you're looking to book yourself on a show and you're into sports, but you're looking at business podcasts, well, then there's going to be a mismatch between your topic and what they want to hear about. So that will be a complete waste of your time. So do that initial research before you know, you go ahead and try to reach out to a host to book yourself in for a call. Nine times out of 10, you won't get past the first step anyway, because the host will say exactly the same thing I'm saying. We're not a good fit. Um, Thanks for your interest. And uh, they'll leave it at that. So you really got to make sure that you're aligning, you align your expertise, your industry, and what you're interested in with that of the, the podcast, uh, the host and their audience. And when you do find that alignment, Oftentimes it won't be completely perfect, but I, it will be very close. You, you'll know that if you're on a sports podcast and you talk about sports, that that's generally going to be a, a good match. Now, there are some nuances to that. If you're talking about a specific sport, um, then again, it might fall outside the scope of what that podcast is looking for. So it does take a bit of um, research, a bit of investigation to find out which shows are going to be a good, uh, good fit for you. But you get to a point where you're ready to pitch yourself. And when you do that, it's a matter of having a plan of how you're going to pitch yourself and what you're going to say in the initial outreach email. And I talk a lot about all of these things inside of my upcoming book, which I'm very excited about. It is taking some time to get written because I want to make sure it's the best it can possibly be. But rest assured, it'll be in there. And, you know, within that pitching process, you've got to be very clear on what you're going to be able to offer the host and their audience. So you need to highlight those unique angles, your perspectives, your expertise and the topic that you plan to talk about and what you're going to do after the podcast. How are you going to promote the show? You're going to let them know that uh, that's your plan. You're going to certainly um, promote them um, after the interview is done. Then before you go any further, come into the show prepared by knowing exactly what you're going to talk about. I often Um, have a a set of bullet points that help me guide conversations as a host. And there is no reason why, uh, as a guest, you can't do a similar thing so that you can give that information to the host and say, listen, this is what I really want you to cover. If you can cover these plus whatever else you want to cover, that would be fantastic. And nine times out of 10, you'll find that the host is uh, thankful because you've given them um, a bit of guidance as to what you really want to cover. Too many times I see um, podcast hosts, in fact, just sending out um, um, booking links. They don't precursor it with an application form, which is essentially just asking what you want to talk about and giving them a name and an email and a website, things that, you know, practical things they can use. So maybe offer that to them um, straight up front, which could be you know, very well received, I'm pretty sure. And on the day of the call, one thing I will say is be on time every time. There's nothing worse that, uh, and it goes for the host as well, there's nothing worse than booking yourself in for a podcast interview and then you you rock up and there's nobody there. So don't be that person. Be on time every time. But, uh, you know, if you want to learn more about the things we're talking about here, like uh, podcasting is my everything, Um, And, you know, we've got the Podcasting Central Group on Facebook. I'd love to see you there. Um, Inside of my first book called Welcome to Show 1.0, The Complete Podcasting System for Your Business, um, that is there for you just to say thank you for joining us in the group. Now, that book is normally being sold. It's being sold on Amazon right now, but um, it's free for you just to say thanks for joining us inside the Facebook group. So, again, that's Podcasting Central. Um, come on over. Can't wait to see you there. The group is growing so quickly and so much um, fun engagement. And I'm getting access to different perspectives, different podcasts, different messaging. It's really, really, it's a, it's a good place to be if you're either a business owner, 
uh, looking to be interviewed or you're a podcaster. So again, just come on over. No barriers to entry and I'll see you inside. But uh, last but not least, please drop over to our YouTube channel called My Future Business and like and subscribe to the channel. But that's it for today. Up till tomorrow. See you then. Thank you.